Hi, good morning. Our episode for today is uh, entitled Clarificatory or Clarification for uh, some statement that I have uh, made regarding uh, individuals or group of people inside the Jehovah's uh, Witnesses organization and uh, how they reacted to a particular situation that I have related to some of my videos. Well, in uh, one of my uh, previous videos, I have stated that the elders of the Jehovah's Witnesses are uh, egomaniacs. I have uh, used that uh, term, but I want to clarify here for uh, to set uh, the things straight that uh, I was not, uh, it was not my intention to classify all the elders or to, to make the, all the elders inside the Jehovah's Witnesses organization in a bad light. I do not want to, it is not my intention to classify them as such. Because uh, the reality or the fact is uh, I have so many friends in the religion when I was uh, yet, uh, when I was uh, still in the religion of the Jehovah's Witnesses and uh, serving as an elder. I have seen that uh, some of the elders in the Jehovah's Witness religion are a truly humble person. And, uh, they are not preoccupied of thinking of themselves too high. So, for them, I want to take this opportunity to apologize to you because uh, you are not included on uh, that particular term that I have used in a particular video in the past. Uh, I was uh, mentioning them are the elders being uh, connected to the story, particular story that I have related in the video. And uh, I was not uh, referring to their uh, very nature as a person, as egomania. Even the term that I have used that uh, some of the elders are coward. I was not uh, referring, even if I mentioned that, I was not uh, referring to the very nature of the rap person. I was not saying there that they have acted cowardly in the past, the, uh, in their past dealings with the members of their uh, organization or in some personal uh, interaction with the other persons outside the organization. And I was not saying there that uh, they will become uh, coward in dealing with the circumstances in the future. All I was saying is that they have acted in a cowardice manner and the particular event that I have related in my video. So, as I've said in the premiere of uh, this channel, and the very first video in this channel, I want, I will make my best to be able to discuss the topics regarding the Jehovah's Witnesses in a fair way. And I believe that the foundation of being fair is the truth itself. Yes, I want to emphasize that all the stories that I have related in my past videos and I will relate in the future videos that I am going to make in the future are all based in two events. I will not... Uh, employ lies or use lies only to defame any individual or uh, 
even the Jehovah's Witnesses as an organization rule uh, just because I was uh, harboring any ill feelings toward them that is not true and it is not true also that uh, a particular religion is hiring me to slander them or to defame them it is not true if I may join any particular religion in the future and uh, it will uh, the decision is uh, was uh, mine for uh, it is uh, for me to make that if it is uh, what I want that uh, religion has no connection whatsoever and the videos that I was making this past few months and, uh, and the videos that I will make in the future so again I want to apologize to the all good people inside the organizations some of them are my friends that may have uh, been hurt by uh, my comments and my past videos but I was also I also want to make it clear that I was not recanting the facts and the information that I have related in the past. All of it are truthful information and are based on the truth, based on the Bible, and based on the true events that I have a personal knowledge. So, again, sorry for uh, the uh, bad uh, feelings that uh, my videos may have uh, made with you that may have uh, made you uncomfortable and uh, I want I just want to reiterate that this channel or the videos I was making here is intended for the common good because I believe I truly believe and it is still the truth that the Watchtower organization and the religion of the Jehovah's Witnesses are still telling or teaching lies to the members and to the other people in the community when they spread their teachings and I do believe I firmly believe as the Russian Federal Supreme Court that those teachings these teachings that the Jehovah's Witnesses propagates has a detrimental effect on the lives of people. That is why the Russian government or the Russian Federal Supreme Court has banned the religion of the Jehovah's Witnesses. It is the only religion being banned officially by the court and tag it as a criminal organization or criminal way of uh, conducting a uh, plain worship to them yes it will in it is a a clear threat to the lives or health of the people who embrace this uh, teaching from the witch tower and it uh, ruined family relationship at, and endangered the well-being or the social relationship of people embracing those uh, kind of ideologies being propagated by the Jehovah's Witnesses. So I was not uh, uh, retreating or in any way uh, watering down or uh, should I say uh, recanting my uh, firm conviction that I should do this for the common good of those who may view these videos from inside their organization and I was doing this to warm the population or the community that it is uh, disadvantageous to join that religion. This is uh, all for this uh, episode, my dear viewers, and I want also to 
take this opportunity to thank you for continued support and uh, you can be rest assured that I will uh, make uh, hard-hitting videos in the future about the false teachings of the Jehovah's Witnesses uh, continuing positivity of the, the Jehovah's Witnesses and uh, the peculiar way on how they conduct matters inside their religion or their organization. Thank you and uh, stay safe. Have a good day.